What is up everybody? I'm just tapping in with everybody to show you what I've been up to. Um, let's check it out. And then I'll make sure to give a little demo and all that too. So, uh, okay, let me get out of the car here. Oh, I got some sound deadening this is just 18 square feet because I've bought it so many freaking times but I uh, was doing my I want to do the sides of the trunk I already did all the bottom I did the trunk lid I did under the seat right here my latest thing BAM I cut this hole out so this is a ski shoot that some cars come with with it already cut, but mine wasn't. So there's a uh, some light on for you. So that's my box. I want to move some stuff around. Um, my blue lights. Oh yeah, I got some uh, some underglow coming tomorrow, so it'll all glow from underneath, and it's the dream chasing, the dream chasing underglow, so it'll, you know, the the colors chase around the car, so it'll look really dope. I can't wait for that. But uh, put some scar stickers on the inside of my port, um, both sides. I. Uh, Got my second battery in down there. I got everything all done up. Scar sticker. But it makes a crazy difference in sound. So I got my base knob wired up all good. I didn't know where to hide the wire, so I hit it all, you know, it comes out through the trunk and then behind the back seat and then comes out down here, goes under there. And then it goes to there, and then I just have it coming up here. I didn't want to go under the seat and run it over and stuff like that. So, so my seat scoots up and down as I get in the car, so I don't want to mess anything up. All right, let's hear this. This will be a Gucci Mane, at least an M. I'm a walking lead. I look like a robber. You niggas ain't Try to lock me on my throne, but they can't do it. It's like the 30th of town. 
that's pretty much it guys it usually will float a little piece of paper it's pretty wild but I think it sounds really good and you see my voltage I mean that's crazy I I mean if you look I don't have a big three or nothing. That's a factory 180 amp alternator, which is better than most people alternators. That's why I think my voltage is so good, but I don't have a big three. I don't have none of that yet. I don't even have a run going from the alternator to the back because my battery is even in the back. So it's all getting pulled through the factory wire. And so right now I'm at four ohm because I'm afraid to run it at one ohm because of that reason. But, I mean, that's a good, you know, about 2,000 watts, 1,500 or something like that. All going through it, no problem. It's crazy. And my voltage does not drop below 13. But I'm thinking about wiring it to one ohm just to get that extra thump. Uh, had to do some more sound deadening and stuff like that. There you can see my hole up through there. So cut it out pretty good. Let me see if I can get you guys back there. That's my tile. Lay it. Sound deadening. I'm gonna sound deaden all that. I put a couple strips in if you can see them. But I'm going to sound dead in all the sides. I uh, found out in Steve Mead's uh, uh, forums that there's some uh, little flaps in here. I felt them with my hand, but I didn't know what they were for. Come to find out, they're pressure things. So when you close the door, you know, it doesn't pressurize. So that's just letting all my pressure out. So I need to close those off and do some stuff. So... I'm working on it, but uh, got some LEDs to put here. I cracked my light, putting my speaker box in one time right here. Can't really tell, but it's cracked right there. You can kind of tell, but yeah. So it's about to rain the next couple days, so I figured I'd get a video to you guys, but uh. Yeah, it sounded pretty good and uh nice little demo. So alright y'all. Well thanks for watching everybody. Um you know I got 110 subscribers or something like that now, so that's pretty dope and I appreciate it. And uh I don't know, until next time y'all. Peace. I'll show you guys what the lights look like soon. Later.